Good evening and good morning and good afternoon in your country, wherever you are. So, welcome to our live. Um, but before I start, guys, let me know if you hear me, guys, well. I hope everyone is here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Just me and my glass, guys. Alright, today is April 24, 2020, and it's Sunday. We are live in the Palo some longer than already so I hope everyone is here everyone will okay are you guys um, having fun this weekend all right guys seems I um, um, finish or get ready in my life so I was just um, starting our live you know at exactly 9 a.m. so this is normally my scheduled time to do my live cast um, every Sunday at 9 p.m. Philippine time so I know someone's there already. Um, let me know if you guys hear me because I don't know my connection. Is it clear, guys? <laughs> All right, Gizmo is in Thailand. 8 p.m. here. 8 p.m. Just only one hour ahead. Yes, Gizmo, I two hours ahead. <laughs> I thought you're still here in Philippines, Gizmo, because um, yesterday I saw you in a trike. I saw you in a trike that we passed by uh, when I walked down in the road going to my apartment and you just, in the corner, I saw you riding in a uh, trike. So I thought you were here in Philippines or you here in the Polo, but I'm glad that you are in Thailand now. It's boiling hot also, boiling hot also here in the Polo city. It is so hot, like a couple of days now. We are in summer. Not me, I was in quarantine. <laughs> now yesterday I saw you in a trike. <laughs> Ooh. Yesterday, yeah, it was yesterday, it's not the other day. Today is Sunday, uh, Friday, I think that was Friday afternoon. So, Friday afternoon. <laughs> I think Friday afternoon, Gizmo. But anyway, welcome. How are you? Is everyone okay? I miss you guys, you know, this is our um, normal schedule to do my live cast. So, welcome everyone. And I know I had a lot of new subscribers in here. Thank you so much to all of you guys. I know you've been um, totally amazing because you guys supporting my channel by watching all my video. And if you guys, um, you know, watching all of my uh, previous video, what I had in my uh, do in Dumaguete, so hopefully you guys like that video. <laughs> or you guys like my video? <laughs> yeah, when I was in Dumaguete, so I'm glad that, you know, um, you guys watch it. If you have time or um, 
TikTok. Have a look in my video. And that appreciate me a lot. Thank you so much, guys. I flew on Wednesday, 10.30 a.m. from Dipolo. Mm, Wednesday? Yes, because I was arrived from Dumaguete. I was arrived on Thursday. Mm. Yeah, I was arrived on Thursday. So... Uh, maybe it's not you, Gizmo, but anyway, <laughs> I'm glad that you are now in Thailand. So, how many how how many days quarantine, Gizmo? So anyway, welcome everyone, and um, are you guys having fun? <laughs> and some of you guys, if you're planning to go Philippines, this is the best time because the weather it's you know it's summertime here in philippines and most if you are in the province well, it is really hot guys it is nice to explore in uh, tourist spot like nice beaches of fools you know brian hugley good morning to you brian how are you today what have you been doing since you have been back in the prologue? Um, when I arrived in the prologue on Thursday, in Thursday, yeah, and I just working, I know I just read straight to work, a report at the war. So the following day, um, working, and today and yesterday I've been working also. So yes, guys, and um, yeah. I just at work and I don't have time yet to explore so yeah working and by Thursday it is my day off so plan to go visit mom on Thursday so that's my kind of plan this week yeah but today I was working today guys So, Nico, good evening to you, Marianne. Good evening, Angelo. How are you today? Lee Hill, good morning. Yes, I'm all well. Thank you so much. And how about you? Yes, everything is fine. Um, Thanks God, you know. I was um, but it, I was arrived on Thursday, and the uh, following on Friday I have three hours lunch break, so I just quick visit with my mom on Friday. So thanks God, everything will be fine, and yeah, and back to work Saturday and today it's like the normal normal days at work. So yeah just working and hope all of you guys are you know also well or fine you know and enjoy the rest of the week I'm fine thank you go return back had you made a bon voyage a nice trip mm -hmm. Yes, it was, uh, you know, nice trip when, you know, back to the Polog or since I, you know, going to the Polog, it was a nice trip because, you know, the weather and I enjoy my trip in the ferry, you know, it's like, um, it's like a good thing that, you know, it's kind of like of exploring at the same time you enjoy the place you know but it's amazing <laughs> so yes guys and since i put my topic on the thumbnail if you guys uh had a questions about it because i had a uh, subscribers that asking uh you know what what the benefits 
they have in the Philippines when they employed also I'll just if you watching this uh, video so this is the main topic that I I I choose because I, I want to you know let everyone would know about it you know so I just prefer to do a vlog or in a live stream to talk about the topic that um, you guys want to know so um, it's free to ask guys I know you've been there you know if you had a questions and you drop in the uh, chat box that you, we can uh, I'm gonna answer that um, right away so is everyone is here guys have you seen your mom since you've been back yes on friday so i had three hours lunch break on friday so i had a quick visit with my mom so i'm gonna uh, like hide in a in a habal habal we call habal habal the motorbike so i just it's like a drop me in my mom's and you're gonna wait the you're gonna wait me in the road so yeah that it's like a back and forth in the habal habal so i paid 150 pesos for that back and forth habal habal just to drop the things pasalubong for my mom and also visit her to make sure everything is fine and i give a drop also the fruits for her i know it's been like a week that i don't know if she ate like fresh fruit or uh, vegetables or you know like something those uh, fruits that she need to eat so i just dropped that on friday so thanks that everything will be fine so yeah and then back to work so and like yesterday and today is working so yeah good experience it is good experience for me you know um since i love to visit or explore other places so that's also uh you know experience that i enjoyed that trip you know like uh, on my training so And yes, guys. So I know some of you guys confusing about my live cast. So um, this is my normal schedule that I'm doing in my live stream. So we are uh, every Sunday. 9 p.m. so Philippine time so I am here to talk to you guys at every Sunday 9 p.m. so this time works better for me yes and this is why i prefer to do because um it's certain your time in us i think it's what about morning yeah sunday morning in the us and i think afternoon afternoon time in europe or in other country in middle east and also it's a good time for philippines because you know um, finish work or finish having dinner and it's like time to relax so it's it's the you know uh, it's good time or perfect time for me also because when i finish work and have my dinner and relax a little bit and then yeah i can able to talk to you guys with my life so this is the time or best time for me also so i'm glad that i'm back thanks god <laughs> thanks god it's sunday <laughs> yeah 
dia langsung miss to back in the polo and i miss my apartment i miss my room so much guys even you know my bed and this what i feel like you know rest when you know um i am in my bed you know sleeping i was like ah this is <laughs> i'm so <laughs> I'm so missed a lot, you know. This is, I feel like, uh, home in the Polo. Because, you know, guys, I was also in Manila for, you know, how many years. Live in a massive city, but, um, yeah, I just prefer to go back in my hometown, in my province of the Polo. So, this is what I called my home. Sweet home. <laughs> yeah. 9 a.m. in Tennessee. Yes, it's a good time, you know, morning. So since I uh, wake up and have a coffee, have a cup of coffee and or breakfast, you guys, sitting in the balcony watching Filipino vloggers live, it's so amazing. <laughs> So anyway, thank you so much everyone who will be here. You guys are welcome on my channel. So hopefully also I had my new subscribers or friends or uh, subscribers in here that, you know, been, um, Filipino or locals. Please, please guys don't uh, hesitate to join our live chat. So... Comment lang kayo dyan, guys. Uh, my friends, um, pag mag uh, join kayo sa sa live chat, kung Bisaya, so mag-talk din ako ng Bisaya. Okay. We need it's English, so I speak, I answer it English. So, eh, we need it Tagalog, so I can also talk Tagalog. So, we're, we're, uh, I have three languages that I can speak. <laughs> yeah, three languages. The Bisaya, Tagalog, and English. <laughs> so, it's prefer for me to talk in Bisaya. If you guys Bisaya also, then I can uh, able to talk. Because most of the time I talk English because um, uh, lots of my subscribers is you know, English, so I prefer to talk English. So, hopefully, asa na yung mga friend ko diyan na bisaya, wala na join. <laughs> okay, Brian. How many siblings do you have? Okay, and I have one sister and I have one brother. So, I am the youngest. The youngest. John Day, good morning to you, John Day. I was playing Twitter and almost forgot about you. Oh no! But anyway, thank you, <laughs> thank you, and I'm, I am glad that you don't forgot my live stream. <laughs> anyway, thank you, John Day. For me, I do not know anything about employment relationship in the Philippines, but I would be very nice to have some information. Okay, and uh, since I am a private sector, so I'm working as a, you know, my private employer, so I had, uh, I had my three benefits that I have from the government, which is I call, which is we call SSS or the Social Security System. And we had also an, uh, uh, how do you call this? We called Feel Health. That was our medical insurance. So we called Feel Health. That's what I had. And also um, the Pagibig. Pagibig. That is like um, Pagibig fund. It's like about when you. It's a fund like when you able to ha uh, get a housing loan or a salary loan. It's also that uh, we had that three benefits that I had. And, yeah, and also if you had a government, working in a government sector, so they have also, we called, they called, um, 
government service insurance system or we call GSIS. So that's that's uh, that's benefits that we had uh, we get in the Philippines. So I hope you guys um, get that uh, shared to you. So if you guys have further um, questions, you guys uh, join our live chat or put in a comment down below. So I so appreciate it. Thank you so much. And I'm going to read all your comments in here. Norman Spanish, good morning to you. You look so nice today. Have you been to church? No, um, sorry, I didn't go to church. I was at work today. I know God is always the center of my, um, you know, everyday lifestyle living. But um, yeah, I am working today. Rock Jamrat, good morning to you. Rock Jamrat, sunny days in you know <laughs> i know it's sunny days for you and i have a cup of coffee <laughs> anyway how are you doing today rock jam rock and also white van man good afternoon to you i've just had to watch effective workout advert on your channel i'm shattered <laughs> Oh, thank you so much for watching on my adverts. It gives a bonus on me. Thank you so much. And hope all you, <laughs> hope everyone will also do it. It's a bonus for me. Anyway, thank you so much. I so appreciate a lot. So, is everyone okay? And, uh, I would like to hear also my local friends. I know someone's there. Najina siya diri. Najina siya nag-watch din ha. So, dili lang sila mo join siguro sa kuwang live chat. Baka kala nila o dili ako magsalita ng Bisaya. So, mag-Bisaya din ako guys. You know, kay Bisaya man ko. So, kung mag-join mo sa live, mag-Bisaya ko ko. <laughs> So, yeah, hopefully my local friends join our live chat. You guys all welcome in my live, in my channel, so. So anyway, guys, and also our reader today, it is so hot, like, because every time when I do, even on my lunch break, I had two hour lunch break every day, 12 noon to 2 p.m. So when I was suddenly, that's, uh, you know, the sun was pretty hot when I walked down in the road, even I'm using umbrella, it's still like, oh, it's so hot. I can feel when I walk in a street, you know, it is so hot guys I can tell you so if you guys uh, love our weather you know like some of you guys Westerner I know love our weather hot in here if you guys experience you know once you come here in the Philippines especially in the in the province in the province of the Polog city it is so hot like burning hot <laughs> Um, smoking hot than Filipino. <laughs> Joke lang po. <laughs> All right, are you wearing sexy dress? Yes, uh, sexy dress. <laughs> that dress on my thumbnail, if you guys see that. So that's what I'm wearing today. Sometimes I'm wearing a uh, dress like like this. You know, it's like sleeveless in my room because it is so hot guys I can tell you like you know it's humid in the room and it's so hot even I had fun in here it's still hot so anyway yeah just wearing a dress if you guys see oh it is a dress 
Okay, thumbs up. Thank you so much. I so appreciate White Van Man for the thumbs up. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, kim sa kadtong mga friend ko diha nga nag-join sa ato ang live. I shout out na ko na pag mo join sa ato ang live cast. <laughs> Shout out to you. Thank you so much. And also, I'd like to shout out to all my friends and colleagues and, um, yeah, all people that I know in my province. I know I had also. And also, all my friends in Manila, my previous colleague in Manila. So, if you guys were watching all my videos or in my live, shout out to you. <laughs> So, miss you guys. Hopefully, one day, no? Makavisit po ko sa Manila pag mag-vlog. So, na-miss po na ako ang Manila, guys, because uh, how, many, how many years? Since 2019. So, I resigned my job in 2019 and back here in the fall of, so... 19, 20, 21, 22. So, almost, um, I'm three years now here in the Polo. So, three years I miss Manila. Hopefully, one day, makavisit po ta, guys. You know, explore po ta ginagmay pa sa Manila. Okay, and, um, asa na ba yung iba? Is everyone is here? If you guys want questions, Please don't hesitate to join in our live chat. Filipino vloggers here, Mary Ann, or Mary Ann. <laughs> and yes, um, You see me guys, I was like, um, napit in Hubbard because I don't have day off yet since I arrived in, um, in Dumaguete and if you, if you can see I had a lot of, you know, dirty clothes that I'm going to wash maybe on my day off on Thursday. So yeah, by Thursday, that's all I'm going to do and cleaning my room and then yeah go visit mom yeah. and i miss also like you know maybe have in the afternoon or when i arrive from mom so i'm gonna sit down in a boulevard maybe you know Normally, that, normally that's what I do, you know, when i back in my room, I was just go down in the boulevard, sitting, you know, it's watching um, the sunset or, or maybe I grab some snacks. You know, it's just because it's few steps from my apartment, the, the boulevard, you know. And if you guys, you know, uh, have time, to take um, take a look in my previous video so so that you guys can follow um what i had or my day in my life or lifestyle living what i had so i had a previous video that you guys you know take back anyway and then i so appreciate a lot thank you so much guys Okay, got it. Okay, thank you so much, Angelo. I know, I think, um, some of my subscribers confusing about my time, you know, um, about a live cast time. So, because last time I was doing 10 a.m., but now. Since I back to the prologue, this is our um, normal live cast every Sunday. Every Sunday, 9 p.m. Philippine time. Oh, 
um, let's just fix my phone, guys. Uh oh, in here. Uh oh. -oh. So if you can see guys even at night time in my room I can feel the humid and it's you know it's like hot. Even I put number three in my fan. Can you imagine still sweating? It is so humid in my room. And if you guys want to know about what it looks like in my room, I had also a video for that. And yeah, it's so hot guys in here. Normally, uh, we suffer like that, you know, when it's summertime because I can tell you guys how hot it is and it's humid in your room. Maybe you need an uh, aircon in your room. <laughs> the air condition. Yes, and anyway, thank you so much for the thumbs up, guys. And I so appreciate Okay, as I know yung mga friend ko dyan na alam ko may mga yung mga kilala kong or mga friend kong locals mga bisaya more I know uh <laughs> Please join our live chat, guys. If you can mag join mo or ang bisaya, okay lang. Okay lang. At least appreciate you kayo na po kung you know, mag join mo o mag join mo o bisaya or mag comment mo o bisaya. Mas malipay po kayo po no? Kanang para, you know, parang it's like, uh, you know, how can express the feelings that imo hang friend or bisaya nga nag you know nag support or nag join sa imo much more pud na nako ma appreciate no so <laughs> so bisan ba pajuk ko ka wala pajuk ko ka um oh no naman before but uh dili yun most of the time wala jud sila ni ni join kay or maula sila kay nag-speak og English pero usa mo kabalo nga mag-speak og Bisaya og Bisaya pud ang ako ang kaistorya so no so ana lang na siya guys <laughs> reader reader lang <laughs> it's like reader reader lang okay and asa na yung iba and So, nito kayo na po lang. Ang mga dogs po. Ang mga neighbor's dog. Oh, oh. So, uh, let me know guys if this is the best time for you. I know I have uh, new subscribers or all of you guys because some of my uh, subscribers also are this is you know fit time to do in my life and um, if you guys uh, you know I have also the new subscribers I'm not sure if it's fit in your time that uh, my time on my life is it okay for you guys uh, you can also uh, join our live chat or put in a comment down below if it's fit on your time so and also that appreciate me a lot thank you so much Lee Hill I only speak one language very badly 
What's that language? Uh, me, I know. What language is that? Lee? <laughs> Hopefully, it's not Bisaya. <laughs> it's not Bisaya. I know some of you guys, you know, like, uh, wanted to know. If you guys want to learn Bisaya, then I can also, you know, teach here Bisaya or you can um, adapt what's the meaning of that word in Bisaya or, you know, you understand. So, also, that's why I can also um, speak Bisaya into one word or stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Learn more Bisaya. Do you give Dipolog a thumbs up? He joined his time there. Have you climbed the 1,000? No, that's 3,003 steps. Yes, um, Gio is doing a vlog because he was here in Dipolog, you know, exploring, doing a video on the 3,003 steps. And that that time, I also uh, get ready to travel to Domageti. And yes, he was here in Dipolo uh, touring. He climbed 3,003 steps. Uh, glad that he climbed that after the top and when it's suddenly totally raining <laughs> that time. So it would be nice if that weather is good and he can fly his drone and make a drone shot in the 3,003 steps and you will see around what it looks the prologue is. It's pretty amazing when, um, when the weather is nice that time that he can uh, you know, sh uh, get a drone shot at the top. It's pretty nice but it's raining a lot so... <laughs> Yeah, and I know it's pretty hard to climb the 3,003 steps. It is. So I was experienced that time. 100 steps, I was like, oh. and then another 200 steps. I was like, every step I get tired, but thanks God, you know what, how many steps I reach? It's only 500 steps. <laughs> I was so tiring and yeah, that's the time we go back because it's already lunch time and you know, it's, it's, you know, feel hungry and start. So if you guys planning to climb in the 3,003 steps, I think make sure that, you know, it's like, you've been working out first you know like work out that keeps your you know like your muscles and totally you know like um we need to exercise before you climb and then make sure it when you climb it should be early as much as possible like 5 a.m or 6 a.m in the morning you've been able to start climb the 3003 steps so the, and also you bring uh don't forget to bring guys the water it is very important water or food like banana or fruits or something food that you we will pack to bring anyway they have also stores that you can buy drinks and foods or they have a uh, you call it small store at the top of that uh Lina Book Peak, we call that Lina Book Peak. They have also the Sari Sari store that you can buy in there, but uh, I suggest to bring your own food, you know, and water. So, and also early in the morning, you uh, start climbing that, so that, <laughs> oh God, it, it's not, you know. So, but I was, I was also, trying but hopefully one day when i can able to climb I, I would love to back in there and i would like to reach that 3003 steps one day so yeah <laughs> just english oh, okay 
Why is it badly? But you speak English if and you are English person. It's not bad to talk <laughs> English. Unlike unlike we Filipina, it's we had. I mean, some of mostly Filipinas speak fluent English, but um, some could not. But we understand. So. <laughs> Because it, it's not our language, but um, we understand and we can able to talk, but it's not like fluent English. <laughs> so, Brian Hodley, I could do three steps. <laughs> yes, three steps. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, have you climbed those steps? It's good exercise. Yes, I've been 500 steps only and then back, backward. <laughs> it's not because I feel hungry and you know, we don't bring that food. We're not ready to climb. So um, one day I would, I would love to go back and climb that again. I'm gonna bring sure that you know food and water. Earl, good morning to you. How are you today? It is raining morning in Missouri this morning. Uh oh, but here we had so hot weather today. <laughs> Do you rent motorbikes around you? And do you know maybe how much per day? I'm sure are happy to back in the polo. Yes, um, Earl, thank you. I am so happy and lucky that I back the polo in my hometown. And speaking of if you guys planning to rent a bike, um, they do not have in here yet so that's mean you know it's good business that you guys planning if you want to do that because yeah i'm um, renting a motorbike they don't have that here but i'm not totally sure but when i look at around the city in here in the polo i know only know that um it's just selling or you know like uh, monthly monthly like renting a month but it's yours it's like what do you call that? monthly payment is something like that but um renting in an hours or in a you know like all day I'm not quite sure guys they don't have her in the uh, depot long. so it's a good business although you know because you know no one can do a business like that it's like renting a motorbike Ricardo good morning to you thank you for being here I'm all good and hopefully you are well also Joe Bird good morning how are you today I'm glad that um, you guys in here thank you I like to hike. Um, yeah, me too. I like to hike, biking, um, exploring, climb in a mountain, going in a nice place. Yeah, I mean, I like I like also hiking, biking. That's um, you know, it's like if I something bored or nothing to do, I just go. That's why I go walk walking hiking in the boulevard yeah. Look at that, guys, and my eyes are so tiring. 
So maybe in 15 minutes or 20 minutes we will pack pack up because look at my eyes guys. It's so tiring. I don't have day off yet since I arrived. But on Thursday after go visited mom I was just you know rest nap. It would be nice you know, when you had a nap and uh, proper food on the table. Be amazing. I usually hike mountain trails and waterfalls. Wow, uh, yeah, that would be nice if you had that. You know, I like also mountain walking in the trails, and after walking, when you see a beautiful view you know that would be nice i like also but um here in you you could not see that in the proper you know in the proper city in the proper town or in a downtown city i mean but once when you are travel two to three hours and you go to the mountain and you can see that mountain trails waterfalls you know beautiful scenery in the mountain you will see that but in the city you have to you know ride in a motorbike or um, whatever you know cars or what uh, vehicles you've been but in the city but um it's not good thing in the city in our city in Nicola because it's not like hustle and puzzle it's like in um, big cities that you know crowded and pollution and traffic but here in Nicola we, we don't um, we don't encounter that I mean I mean they have traffic when they have like activities you know in the in the road or in the city but um normally um, it's not really like it's different totally different when you are in the city do you like running also i like to run about three times a week yes i like also running that's what i did um it's not now <laughs> because I'm naked and tiring. Um, I was able also to do a run in the boulevard. Uh, the Polo Boulevard is, you know, it's nice to go running in the morning or in the evening because 2.6 kilometers you will run that back and forth, you know, every day. It's, it would be nice. And yes, I love also running. That's what I did. Go run in the boulevard. Brian Hogley, how long does it take to you to travel to see your mother? It is far away. Um, no, it when you ride in a bike, normally it is only um, 15 to 20 minutes. It, it depends on your fast and ride, but normally I don't ride in a motorbike fast. So it takes 20 minutes to ride in a motorbike from here in the city of Dipolo to mom's house. So I had also a video uh, that Brian, if you had uh, free time, of if you had a lot time to take back a look, I had also a video in riding in a multi cab or in a motorbike. We called it habal habal in here. So yeah, I had that uh, vlog. And also province life, day in a life in a province. I had that also in my previous vlog. So George Blanket, uh, hey, I made it. <laughs> okay, glad that you made it. Join our live chat. Thank you so much, George. I so appreciate your time. Mm 
Norman Spanish. You much <laughs> believe it. You much is try to your mom's house. Huh? What do, how much? What do you mean uh Norman? How much a try? Um from here the polo, especially when I in the market. So I'm gonna um grab a trike or it's not a trike. Trike is very expensive than habal habal because it's like a double. And trike from the polo to go to mom's house it is two hundred pesos. It just only drop there two hundred pesos. So once I ride in motorbike, we call it habal habal. It it costs only one hundred pesos. So. And if I had just like a quick time just to drop uh, things or food for mom and then back uh, and then back in my work. So it just if you drop that back and forth, it cost uh, you can you can um, I call it negotiate with the driver. It costs only 150 pesos. Just back and forth and just. A minute so the, the drivers will wait you in the road like a minute so so it that 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 matters it cost uh, 150 pesos so the boulevard is about three miles long or shorter um, 2.6 kilometers I'm not sure how miles it is but we use kilometers so 2.6 kilometers that uh, boulevards in the polo. Sorry, how much? Yeah, it's okay, Norman. I know. I, I still, I still got, uh, I still got your uh, questions. George Blanket, glad you are home. Yes. This is totally I miss it. <laughs> the home sweet home. Home sweet home guys. I miss my bed, my pillow. <laughs> and also I miss everything here in the polo as well. And of course my mom because you know um, every week I go visit her. Uh, make sure that she's all right, she's fine, and she had medication. So that's that the most, you know, that matters most to me, you know, um, with my mom. Navin Kumar, hello, good afternoon. Is afternoon in Ireland. Thank you for uh, joining, Navin Kumar. How are you today? And also Raul D, thank you so much. Good morning. How are you today? Thank you for joining. Yeah, it's good to see you also in here. I am good. It is good that you know. Miss the polo. <laughs> it's like oh my god, it's like it's like like long, you know. It's just only three weeks. <laughs> I'm so crazy. Yeah, it's just the thing that uh, you know how how I love my hometown and missed it. Thank you so much for the information. I appreciate it. Please, ha please have a blessed evening, and hope you are na mom is doing well. Okay, yeah. thank you so much, Earl. Thank you also for your time. Are you married? No, I am not married. Never been married. Sorry for being late today. No, totally, you're not late, uh, George. Actually, I still appreciate your time. You're not late. So, you guys don't um no need to say sorry 
but I would love and appreciate your time to join my live cast. Mm -hmm. And you guys, if you can see, I'm going to turn my camera. So you can see that. Door is open. The door is open. The window is open. But they have a screen door. Because it is so hot, guys. You know. I'm going to close that. Of course, when I finish live. And when I about to go to sleep so but when since I awake I leave open because it is so humid so that's long enough to get good exercise I'm impressed how clean the body part I had seen the previous vlog that is very clean yeah it is so it's very clean and nice to sit down and you can grab food in there, you know. The food that affordable for locals. <laughs> okay, thank you for the thumbs up remind, George. Anyway guys, in 5 minutes, I'm gonna go because I need also to rest. I need a rest. <laughs> I need a rest. Look at see my haggard eyes. Oh no, tired eyes. Working. Hard work for my better future. So, anyone would like to ask before I go, please don't hesitate to join our live chat if you um, want questions, you know, if you had had a questions and, you know, want to know, I am here, guys. shine <laughs> it's so bright because I just I forgot just only using one light so I had lights on I mean three lights on in here so that it will be like uh, clear You have a great night's sleep. Okay, thank you so much, George Plunkett. The internet shows that Dumaguete and Dipolog have about the same population, but Dipolog seems cleaner, less population, less pollution, and less traffic on video. Does it seem that way, you too? Yes, it is. Internet in the polo, it depends or, you know, it depends on location where you are. Like, for example, um, um, there are places also that, you know, it's hard to adopt internet signals, you know, in the, polo, in, in the proper city of the polo. You don't have to worry. But when you travel, like, into other barangays or especially in mom's house in our barangay guys 
to, you know, the internet was not good. <laughs> but in the city, you don't have to worry. And it is cleaned and no traffic, like you said. It's no pollution. This is according to. <laughs> oh no! You don't forget that lyrics with the Spice Girls. <laughs> Glad to see you, Mira. I hope you are mom is place. Thank you so much, Raul. Yeah, everything is fine. Enjoy your night, Marianne, and bless. Good rest. Okay, thank you so much, Ricardo. Thank you so much for your time. And blessing to you as well. Will you have to go back to Doma? Um, yes, why not? I'm planning to go back. It's just a story. <laughs> I'd like to go back, like, you know, touring, going to Valencia, since I'm going to Siki Hall, so I'm back, I'm back, yeah, I'm back. I'm going to Valencia, the of the Maghidi, so I'd like to go travel to Valencia, or um, from the Maghidi, two hours to travel to Siki Hall. Or, um, no. it's like a province of it. I'd like to go back to see like that mountain that they had in the Maghidi. Yeah, my connection is bad, but now it's back. It's bad. All right, guys, I think in uh, five minutes I'm gonna go. So, if you guys uh, one question before I go because I um, feel sleepy as well. My time is so I think it's everyone say good night now. So I'm gonna go and pack up and get ready because. It's a long day and a right day tomorrow at work. So I'd like to say thank you everyone who will be joining our live stream, our live cast tonight. So hopefully I'll see you guys in my next live every Sunday at 9 p.m. Philippine time. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time. I'll see you guys in my next live. God bless you all. Good night. Stay safe, everyone.